Hey everyone, Josh Merhar here, and today I'm going to show you how to actually use a metronome to improve your time. Playing with a click on the beats will only get you so far, but learning to play with a click that hits only the E or A uh of a beat is like injecting your internal clock with anabolic steroids. Now before we get into this, the title of the video is not an attack on anyone or me trying to say my time is awesome and yours sucks, it's just clickbait, don't take it personally. But anyway, I've seen this concept mentioned many times before and even by some of my favorite drummers, but it's always presented so casually, like, oh, just put the click on the E of each beat and your time will get better. Problem solved. But if you ever tried that, you know it's not that easy. In fact, it's really f***ing hard. So I'm going to break down a progression that'll help you place the click on the 16th offbeats. First, we'll work to get the click on the uh of each beat. I'll keep steady 16ths on the hi-hats with a basic backbeat thing underneath, and I'll start by playing right on the click, just like normal. When that's locked in, I'll nudge the kick and snare back by a 16th, so it's like they land on the E of each beat. At least it'll sound that way at first. Now this is the hard part. You need to trick yourself into feeling the E of each beat as the downbeat, which will make the click sound like it's on the uh of each beat. You might want to start by accenting the click with the hi-hats to get into it, and then once you feel a little more solid, you could switch those hi-hat accents to match up with the kick and snare again. It might take a while before your ear really accepts the new one, so be patient, go slowly, and grind it out. Switching the click to the uh of each beat sounds like this. Once you feel good holding the click on the uh of the beats, switch the hi-hat pattern to 1 e and, 2 e and, 3 e and, 4 e and. So now the click will land in that space left open by the hi-hat pattern, and that sounds like this. After you're comfortable holding the click in that 16th space, switch to playing just 8th notes on the hi-hats. The click might try to pull you back to lining it up on the beats, but that stupid click is picking a fight with the wrong drummer. You're gonna tell that click to go pound sand and you're gonna keep it in its place because you know what's best for the both of you. Next, we gotta get the click on the E of the beats. For whatever reason, I find this much more difficult, but don't let me set expectations for you. So we're gonna go back to playing steady 16ths on the hi-hats with the click on the beats, but we'll displace the kick and snare the other way. They'll get nudged ahead by a 16th, so it'll sound like they land on the uh of each beat. And you have to trick yourself again, but now into feeling the uh of beat 4 as the new beat 1, which puts the click on the E of each beat. Follow the same process as before, just hold that groove down until your ear begrudgingly accepts the new one.
When you have the click locked onto the E of each beat, switch the hi-hat pattern to one and a two and a three and a four and a. Just like before, the click will land in the space left open by the hi-hats. When you feel good holding the click in that 16th space, switch to playing just 8th notes on the hi-hats. Again, that stupid click is going to try to muscle you into lining it up on the beats, but you're going to show it who's boss. From there, start filling out the grooves more and try playing fills without letting that click budge out of place. If you really put in work with these exercises, your time is guaranteed to improve. Just be patient and persistent. If you like what you saw in this video, check out my Patreon page. Your support grants you access to transcriptions for this video, as well as transcriptions for all my other lesson videos. And follow me on Instagram at drummerhar to see more videos of my playing. As always, thanks for watching and see you next time. Time. <laughs> next time. And this lesson is about time. <laughs>